Hello, my name is Zain Assad from Assad Z-Man Films and today I'm going to be reviewing these RGB 10S LED video lights that I received from GVM. That's a great video maker. I've had these lights for about, I would say, three months now. I've only used them once actually for a photo shoot. The photos came out really brilliant actually. These are RGB, so red, green, blue, whatever. You could create basically any color that you want without using gel or filters. And I think they're really good. Uh, they're on Amazon for about, like I think, you get two of them right now for $110 or like one of them for like 60, 70 bucks. They're actually really good lights. I love the design of these. They're plastic, of course. They go from 3200K to 5600K. They're pretty bright, actually, for the light. They have a CRI level of 97 plus with 240 high color rendering index LED beads. They are also bicolor, and then so it could go from uh, cold to warm. It just de it just depends on the scenario you're in and what you prefer. But I like them because they're small and they're portable and I could just like grab them and go. So this is basically the bag that it came in. It's like a velvet bag. It's actually pretty nice. It keeps everything inside the bag so you could just like pick up the bag and take it to go. It's pretty useful. Let's just see what uh, is basically inside the bag. So the first thing that's inside the bag of course is the little mount for the light. You put this on the light and then you can attach it to your camera or tripod. The second thing is the battery charger. This is like just a wall plug battery charger basically. Just simple plug and charge. Um, just pretty cool, you know, very standard. The third thing that's in the bag is the tripod that it came with. So it came with like a tabletop tripod. It reminds me of the Manfrotto tripod. If you guys ever seen those, I actually have one. But um, yeah, it's basically, you know, tabletop, very, you know, low angles, low, like, you know, right there, you know, which makes sense because it does fit inside the bag, so that's pretty cool. And then finally, the light uh, fits in the bag. This is the light, of course. Uh, it has a tripod mount, you know, basically. Uh, it's an all right build, but if you were to drop these, they would probably break, but it's okay. Like, I'm not gonna, like, try to drop them or anything like that. I know. Uh, these are like perfect. These are small. You could like put them into like tight corners or small spaces, you know, and they're really bright actually. So it works really well. Also, it has the battery right here. It's like basically an NP550 battery like Sony thing. You know what I mean? But it's pretty cool because it comes with the battery and then the battery charger and the tripod and the mount for the tripod. So it's a pretty good little setup. Uh, you get two of these, of course, for like 110 bucks. I don't know if they're still available at the moment. I'll try to leave a link in the description. But if not, I'll probably just put like a single light. And I thought it was a pretty good deal. This is how it looks all together. Um, yeah, I mean, you know, you could hold it in your hand and stuff like that. You could. Uh, angle the light different at different angles and stuff like that um, Yeah, the, I could say that the the tripod is actually pretty sturdy and the mount for it is actually pretty sturdy Of course you could angle the tripod differently because of the head and Yeah, I think uh, these are pretty cool You know just to have laying around just in case you need like some sort of small light to put somewhere like I don't know I think they work good. I would I would use these for like interior lighting, like car lighting or like um, closet lighting or I don't know, a whole bunch of small spaces to put these lights in. Which is and they're really bright lights actually. They have a really good LED. They have really good LEDs and stuff like that. So yeah, this is how it looks. This is it with the light on and stuff like that? You can just like hold it. So yeah, so the uh, just the battery, you could just like plug in the battery. Basically, like this is the back of it. This is the back view of the light, and you could just like basically get that NP550 light and, or battery, NP550 battery, and just plug it in, and then turn on the light. And yeah, you just like you could switch. You could switch like that's the brightness. You could switch the hue, the saturation, the CCT. I think that's the color temperature, basically. You switch the color temperature of it, which is pretty cool. So yeah, like to switch the hue from like different, like different colors and stuff like that. You turn up the saturation all the way, saturation all the way to like 100%, and then that's when you could. 
um, switch the the hue and to make it into like a whole bunch of different little colors that any color that you could really think of, which is really cool actually. And all it, all it is is just these nozzles, these knobs on the back, and you just change it. So yeah, that's the that's the camera, of course. It does come with two of them and stuff like that. So yeah, and then this is this is how the light looks without the without the um, diffuser actually on. So these are the beads inside, all the LED beads and stuff. And I gotta say, it does make a difference with the diffuser on rather than it off. So yeah, and they're really nice beads actually. I gotta say. They look really, really nice and professional and stuff. For such a small light, like to have this type of bead technology is really cool actually. And here's like a little preview of like all the different colors that you could create basically with the light and stuff. So yeah, hope you guys enjoy this little montage of the colors.